Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. Two police officers were shot Saturday night in Detroit. A manhunt underway for the person or people responsible. It happened at Greenfield and Florence. Again, police sources tell us two Detroit officers have been shot. At least one Russia Sinai Grace Hospital. We're working to get more information. We'll bring you the latest as soon as it comes in. The family of a young woman killed and tossed in a Detroit dumpster sharing her heartbreak. 7 Action News spoke exclusively to the mother and brother of Elizabeth Candace Laird. The victim's mother, Diana, says she's broken up in a million pieces. Her brother, Curtis, says the suspect, James Cockerham, should have never been let out of prison. The alleged killer previously served time for rape. He's arrested Saturday afternoon at a home on Detroit's west side. A Michigan congressman representing Grand Rapids is the first Republican lawmaker to call for President Trump's impeachment. On Twitter, GOP Congressman Justin Amash told his followers, quote, Mueller's report reveals that President Trump engaged in specific actions and a pattern of behavior that meet the threshold for impeachment, end quote. Severe weather possibly on the way. Let's take a look at how it's all going to play out with Mike Taylor. Mike. Yes, for tonight, things are going to be relatively calm and mild. We'll have an overnight low near 60 degrees, partly cloudy, and the storms will be north of Detroit. Different scenario for your Sunday. We'll hit a high of 80 degrees. We'll be warm and humid. It's going to feel like summer, and we'll have some summertime storms in the afternoon as well as the evening, and they could be strong to severe. Thanks to a cold front and the evidence of that, we'll go from 80 on Sunday down to 65 on Monday, and then we're inviting more storms back in here as we get towards your Wednesday, and temperatures return back to the 70s. Those are your headlines. Remember, you can always go to WXYZ.com and our app for news anytime. Have a great day.